Yo, what's going on everybody? We are here in an apartment. <laughs> so I know you're used to seeing me out on a beach or a pool or something, but I'm actually in Kentucky now on the photo tour shooting with girls. And we got here to outside Lexington, Kentucky, and we are shooting today, tonight actually, with Kayla Solshine. Check this babe out. Smoking hot, country girl, rural, girl next door with the naughty side, totally. Uh, you can check out her OnlyFans, I'll uh, link to her Instagram and her stuff in the video. So make sure to go check her out, it's awesome. And we're gonna have her in the issue of uh, Bikini Girl Magazine, so make sure to go to bikinigirlmagazine.com and uh, you can subscribe to the monthly digital magazine. You get the monthly digital mag downloadable to your cell phone and also you can have it, uh, you get the uncensored videos that we can't show on social media because they banned me. So uh, all the hot stuff. So uh, make sure to also go to our YouTube channel, uh, Bikini Girl Magazine on YouTube. That's our other channel where we have a lot of the hot and sexy videos, not the instructional ones like this. So uh, we're gonna get started. This is, uh, we've got this awesome Airbnb that we're gonna shoot at today. I guess the first thing we're gonna do is check out some gear. Yeah. So the, the lighting in this place is really subdued. Um, I was actually kind of surprised about that. They really don't have a lot of overhead light. It's an old building and they just have a lot of um, kind of like fixture lights, stuff like that. So what I did was I just set up my LED panel to bounce it off the ceiling and just kind of get some more light in here. So because we're working in limited space, I think what we're gonna do is the first scene is gonna be this just nice green couch like right there. She's got a sexy bikini for it. But we're gonna use this uh, ProMaster 300 watt and I've got a beauty dish with a honeycomb grid. So maybe we'll get some like area effect and some light fall off. I've got the photogenic ion for that because an old building like this, I don't really wanna plug into the walls and start running 300 watt lights off of their wall sockets because I've seen the lights flicker a little bit. So always keep that in mind when you're going and shooting indoors in buildings uh, to make sure that you don't have a burnout or something like that. So I brought this second light here and uh, we've got this set up with the scoop and then I have this uh, some gels. And of course, as always, we've got the pocket wizards for the camera. And then for cameras, we are going to do the Canon 7D Mark II with the 24 to 70 millimeter. But I may have to switch over to the uh, wide angle lens just because we're working in tight spaces right here. And that's pretty much it. We'll switch to video. And when we switch to video, I've got the lights on the camera I usually use, the Loom Cube and then also um, just a newer kind of little spotlight. And then what we could do is maybe put some gel lights on the LED panel as well. But that's our gear today, guys. So that's what we're working with because I'm on the road. I got to sleep in a van and have gear in there at the same time. So yeah.
Hey, what's up guys? So if you can't tell, it's the next day. <laughs> totally forgot rolling and started shooting and started getting like super creative and totally forgot to do the little intros before each setting. So um, I'm gonna break that down for you, what we did last night. All right, so we did our third shot in the kitchen, which was pretty hot because I really love this uh, little nook right here. So we were able to get Kayla uh, up on the top of the countertop. She was standing, she was posing here. And then I moved all the way back here so we could kind of get that angle. You can kind of see how I just like the convergence of the two countertops and then Kayla was able to pose in the middle. And what we did was we set up the beauty dish. See in tight spaces like this, you really don't need a lot of light. It's actually, you want less light. And having all these white walls and white cabinets behind me, you want to make sure that you don't overexpose any of that stuff. So I basically set up uh, the beauty dish kind of like right here where I'm talking to. And then we had a little ambient light, my video light, I set up right here and I was bouncing the light off the ceiling just to kick in some extra light into the room. But yeah, that was it. So check it out. shot we were able to get to was the bedroom so we had Kayla in this sexy little green kind of like suspender bikini uh, which was pretty see-through you'll see in the video coming up and we had this amazing just gorgeous bed right there and it worked out well because the green actually kind of matched with the green and then also it was, was a good tone with the wood behind and then the white so what I was able to do was I set up a beauty dish right here, same deal. So it was creating that shadowing effect. And then uh, I had a little ambient light kind of kicking off the ceiling right there with the LED light just to kind of fill spaces in the room. And the cool thing was, was there was this step stool to stand on. So luckily I had something like if I wanted to do a higher up shot, I could just get up right over the bed and then shoot down and get that kind of look. But it came out super hot, I mean, you know, so that's uh, how to do implied nude photos, nude photos in Airbnb. And yeah, this place was fantastic. This was Lexington, Kentucky. And uh, I just found it on Airbnb. It was great. It's just the entire apartment and it worked out pretty well. Okay, it is wrap up time. That was so much fun. Great shoot last night, I had a fun time. Uh, the cool thing was Kayla has actually shoots a lot indoors because of obviously being in Kentucky, they don't have the weather that we have on the West Coast. So she was really comfortable like posing around furniture and everything like that. I want you to go check out Kayla, Kayla Scholl's Shrine, and I'll put her description in the link of the video as normal and uh, make sure to check out Bikini Girl Magazine. I can't talk right now, guys. It's kind of early in the morning. I'm trying to get out of here before the Airbnb kicks me out. Uh, so we're packing up, uh, packing up gear and getting it all done. Uh, but make sure to go check out bikinigirlmagazine.com and you can check out the website and then you can subscribe to the monthly digital magazine. It's only $6.99 a month. You get the digital magazine downloadable to your phone. You get all the uncensored videos that we can't post on the social media platforms because they hate beautiful women. Yes, they do. Every time you post beautiful women on YouTube, Facebook, 
all those stations, uh, websites, they hate them. They ban me. So uh, go check out the Bikini Girl magazine. Support me, guys. And uh, I think that's it, man. I got to get rolling. We're driving 12 hours today to Oklahoma City to go shoot with Rose's Star. So hopefully everything's smooth, smooth sailing. Thanks for watching, guys. Check out, like, share, comment, subscribe to the video. It really helps me out. Go over to my other YouTube channel, which is Bikini Girl Magazine on YouTube. That's where I post the teaser videos from all of these shoots. Um, and yeah, just check it out, guys. Support me online, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for checking out this video, everyone. Did you know that for the price of a six-pack of beer, that you can get Bikini Girl Magazine each month? That's right. You get the digital magazine downloadable to your phone or your desktop, as well as all the smoking hot, uncensored content from the shoots that I can't show on social media. Go to BikiniGirlMagazine.com and sign up as a monthly patron, or you can purchase individual issues via MagForest platform. Your support helps me continue to do all of these sexy shoots for you. The social media censors absolutely hate all of this content of beautiful women, so help spread the word to all your friends. Please make sure to like, comment, or share this video with some friends and click that subscribe button. Also, go follow Bikini Girl Magazine on our second YouTube channel and across social media to keep up with the latest hot babes.